All right, guys, we over here at Linda's Learning Farm. We just pulled up. Uh, they taking care of patches right now, our horse. So I thought I'd come over here and check out Mr. John's gazebo he just built. Um, this man's so talented, I'm telling you. He built this whole place, him and Miss Linda. I tell you, they put numerous and numerous of hours in this place. It's, I mean, days, months, years, years, and you know, a, you know into this place and it's amazing at what they can do check this out guys i remember well not the last time but the time before that i came over here this whole gazebo thing here was just rotten and fell now i think he reused the same post because they're still strong but all the green in the metal up top here he done he done it in no time too i can't believe how quick he's done that he is an amazing carpenter I ain't gonna lie to you he does all this he builds all the fences out here and everything guys going around this place i mean he's built this whole place him and miss linda and now they got it like a little bitty old gazebo and they can hang out up under here and Yep, this is the learning form. Right now, I think they got a uh, summer camp going on for kids and everything. And this is uh, the tractor and everything. They take them, take the kids for a ride and everything around the property. I think they got like 70 something acres out here. And guys, if y'all ever want to maybe come out here and check Miss Linda and John's uh, learning form, here's the info here. Just uh, give Miss Linda a call and, you know, you can set something up maybe. Uh, I'm not sure how they go about doing this, uh, doing things. Uh, like I said, I don't... They might do groups. I don't know if they just do schools or something like that. But you know, you can give her a call, see what she says. But check this out, guys. Here's the pool. It's beautiful. Look at there ready to be swimming now she owns this house too her and mr john that's the house that miss linda grew up in they don't stay in that house they basically use it as a uh, i guess you could say um they got used to bathroom used to bathroom or whatever you know that's where they go when they out in this area guys right now i'm on the way out here to get montana our younger horse and bring her up front check this out there they are patches i mean oops montana montana Let's see if we can get her. Good grief. I think this is Miss Montana. I ain't seen her in, I think, a couple of months because she's been getting trained. Montana, is that you, baby? Hey, what you doing? Huh? Guys, that is Montana. This is our baby horse. She is so beautiful. You want to go up here? Come on. Come on, Montana. You want to go up here? Come on. Let's go see Mama. Come on. Yes, that girl. Come on, Montana. Come on. Come on, Montana. You want a treat? She's not going too well, guys. Guys, this is the second attempt. I got the wifey with me. We're gonna get Montana this time. Oh, and we got Montana? treats. Is that what you said? Montana. Montana. Montana.
Tony Montana. But yeah, we're gonna try again. So we're trying to get this done nice with and um, so we can get on the road. You know, because I know that I think they close like four o'clock up there. Okay, I hate this loud thing. <laughs> I had one hand while we're up. Oh. Hey Moses. Moses, say hey to the camera. Montana. Come here, go. Good friend. She's over here by Savior. Well, yep, here's the second attempt, guys. Steven, aka TT, is going to try this again. There they are. No, she's not skinny. She just got muscle. Anybody bass want in. some? Poop. <laughs> There's dead gum landmines all over the place out here. Watch where you step. Well, there's 13 horses out here. So this is 70 acres. 77. 77? And that's 80 acres over there they're supposed to be getting for the ATV land. Hey, Savior. Hey, Savior. Hey, Montana. Hey, baby. You should hate the camera. Tony Montana. No. Oh, you dropped it. Come on. <laughs> Come, on. Named after Scarface. Come on, Scarface. Dude, what are you doing? You can't eat the camera. <laughs> Watch out for the sticks, guys. Move. Come on. Quit. Leave her alone. Come on, Montana. Come on, baby. My little baby horse. Here. Y'all to try these. These are pretty good. These are called Butterfingers. What? Nah, no, just kidding. <laughs> Savior. Come on, Montana. Yeah, we're trying to get Montana up there because she's got to see. Uh, she's got to get her updated shots and see about Get her updated loaded. shots and Savior, stuff like that. But hopefully, we can get done with this. Come on, Montana. Hey, guys. See you in a second. Those wolf teeth don't look like they're causing any issue right now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. If you could turn your head more towards you, there we go, perfect. That is so This takes a lot, a lot of practice. It's a lot of just learning how to use the tools once you know what to do. Mm -hmm. hmm. Hey, Albert, she's like, oh. she says, "What in the world, Mom?" <laughs> I said, "Mom, what are you doing to me?" To you. She said, "Mom, you've done put me through some stuff." That is all. Just one more little spot here. And that's all she needs. Perfect. Awesome. How's your mouth feel, old girl? She said, I didn't feel like nothing. What are you talking about? She said, I didn't feel like nothing. What are you doing, Miss Patches? You sitting up here chilling, baby? Some medicine and stuff. Okay, yeah. Ooh. Well, that you up. <laughs> Got your fly mask on. Yeah. So, and she, she looks good. She's gonna lose some baby incisors here. Up there. Yeah. So these should be coming about two and a half. So these either are her adults or they're about to just be pushed out. And One, two, three and a half, four and a half. She looks fantastic, though everything is really well lined up. Um, everything is coming in as it should, and she's got enough space uh, in her mouth. 
Well, are you drunk? This is just the worst. Are you drunk? Just the worst. Um, if you wouldn't mind throwing her halter back on, I'll clean yeah. her um, udder and then I'll get a fecal sample from her as well. Well, guys, the horses are all done. Uh, we're waiting for a little bit till we leave so the horses can kind of come back to a little bit. Uh, we're just going to watch them maybe for about 20 or 30 minutes. But here's Montana. My baby's still drunk. She's got her teeth done and everything. She, and she had a fecal sample. She's got her updated. Yep, it's got updated shots and all that. Both horses. Patches is all done. Yeah, she's been having problems with her feet for a long time. We really don't look to be riding her or anything. She's just basically our, you know, grazing horse. She can wander around, just live her life. I think she's like 17 years old. <clears throat> but... She's our baby, so she's just gonna be our little baby pet. She's gonna, you know, just kind of wander around, eat, and have a good life. We love her so much. She's been a great horse, so we can't ride her no more. It's no big deal. She's been beautiful. She's been great. She's an amazing horse all the way around. And this is our youngest one, Montana, that I introduced you to. <clears throat> she just got back from, uh, <clears throat> I guess you say broken in where we can ride her she's i think two years old but yeah she's a beautiful horse that's gonna be my wife's barrel horse right there but guys that's gonna cut it probably for this video here um we're probably for some leave here probably about 30 minutes and we're gonna head up to safari uh, animal safari i guess up in up in Alabama somewhere I'm not too exactly sure where it's at but that's gonna be a whole nother video <clears throat> but guys thank you so much uh, please like and subscribe to the channel please it helps me so much I love you guys so much um, so you guys have a great day and keep in touch thank you